Hi everyone, it's Raleigh. Today I'm opening up the game Pengalo. It's the fun South Pole expedition. <laughs> so a little bit of an Easter theme with Easter coming up. This is for ages four and up and for two to four players. And this is a game I've seen in the stores for a while, so I thought this was the time to try it out. I'm gonna open it up, I'll be right back. Here we are, I've opened everything up. And before I get started, I wanted to show you the box it comes in. Um, and I love this, it comes with little compartments. So when you're done playing, it's really easy to put away and keep safe, it's really good quality. And here's all the pieces that come with it. Here's our instructions, how to play the game. And pretty straightforward, not pages and pages. So it tells you how to get ready. And then here are the pieces. You get two of these dice that have the colors on each side of them. And we also have these iceberg <laughs> boards. So these are the boards where each player is gonna collect their penguins and their eggs on. And all this stuff is made of wood as well. It's really good quality. And here's one of the eggs. So you get two eggs in each of the different colors and then you get 12 of these adorable little penguins. Aren't they sweet? And everything, like I said, it is, is wood. It's really good quality. And so I think this is the kind of game that would last for quite a while. So I'm gonna set up the board. I'll be right back. Okay, we're all set up to play. So each player has an iceberg board in front of them. That's to keep track of how many they've collected. You've got the dice. And then under each of the penguins, they've all been mixed up, is a different colored egg. And the game is pretty straightforward. So the object is the first player to collect six penguins with their eggs. And so set up the board like I have here. And then usually you start with the youngest player. They're going to roll the dice. And the goal here is whatever color dice you roll, you want to find those eggs. So on this roll, I was lucky. I found the yellow egg. Going to see if I can find a... Oh, I did find a blue one. Neat. Now, if you do find two, both your eggs, you do get another turn. And then, of course, if you don't, if you only get one and then you miss it or you miss both, then it goes on to the next player. And when you get your egg, of course, you put it on the board. The first one to get six wins. And a couple other notes they have for playing the game, things that you can add to the game, which is that Either players can help or can give false information. Um, uh, or you can also allow for uh, eggs to be taken away from other players. So if you leave the eggs hidden on other people's boards, you can decide to play where you can also choose those ones too. It's up to you. But the goal of this is to, of course, get six. Whoever gets six first is the winner. So I think this game is really cool. I like it the way it's designed to be played you know, from the company, the way it's set up. But I also think there'd be lots of neat opportunities for someone or for kids or anyone to come up with their own variations on the game. And I also think the play pieces would just be neat for kids with their imaginations. I'm sure they could make up lots of stories and games about penguins and their eggs. Um, so overall, I think this was a great buy. Uh, the, the cost was about $24, which is a little higher than most, but I think a good value. So I would definitely recommend this. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, leave a comment and let me know. See you soon.